Hello, Sandstrom Stallions. Mrs. LeBeau here, and I'm so excited to read this book to you today. It is called Troll 234, and it is by Steve Smallman and Jamie Temerick. <clears throat> Troll 234. Trolls like to laze around, twiddling their toes, picking their noses, and having a doze. They love to creep up behind goats and go boom, except for one sad, lonely troll, Boogaloo. The other trolls tried but could not understand why Boogaloo felt so alone in troll land. All I want is a friend, he thought with a sigh. And just then a shiny red thing floated by. Do you see the shiny red thing? <laughs> He ran after the thing and was running so fast, he went straight by the sign that said, no troll should go past. I can see it. A second troll followed behind Boogaloo thinking, where is he going? I want to go too. They walked through the keep out clouds straight to a place where a human being stood with a very shocked face. The human being screamed, I see trolls! And he fled as a third troll came out of the cloud. There he is. Another troll, number four, followed them too, marching in line right behind Boogaloo. <clears throat> And before you could say, Boogie Boo, there were crowds of curious trolls popping out through the clouds. Trolls foul and furry were marching along, singing their favorite troll marching song. Troll two, three, four, we're the trolls who grunt and snore. Troll two, three, four, we don't know there might be more, but we can only count to four. <clears throat> the humans were frightened. The trolls looked so scary, so scruffy and smelly, so horrid and hairy. As the trolls passed a park, Boogaloo snuck away. He opened the gate and he ran in to play. In a house just nearby, a boy stood on a chair. He whispered, hey, look, there's a troll over there. He looks a bit lonely. I'll just go and see if maybe he'd like to play with somebody like me. Hello, said the boy, my name's Jake. Who are you? The little troll smiled and said, Boogaloo. Come play on this whiz thing, Boogaloo cried. All right, answered Jake, but we call it a slide. You're doing it. <laughs> Will you be my very best friend, Boogaloo? Yes, please, the troll answered. Will you be mine too? And humans and trolls all crept closer to see what very best friends trolls and humans could be. There is nothing between trolls and humans today. The signs all came down, the clouds drifted away. Together they play with balloons and toy boats and no one is frightened not even the goats. And that is Troll, Troll 234. Two, three, Thank you so much for watching today. And if you would love to, in the comments below, um, post a picture of a troll that you've drawn or maybe a troll that you make out of clay or Legos or whatever you want, I would love to see it. Bye, Sinstrom Stallion, see you soon.